Hello everyone, my name is Ame Ahir and I'm a technical marketing engineer on the Cisco Meraki wireless team here at San Francisco, California. Today, we are looking at a new gift from Cisco Meraki, our flagship MR57 access point. Wow, our New Year's gift really came late this year. We are super excited to share this gift with all of you folks. This is our brand new flagship MR57 access point. Now let's go ahead and look at what the AP looks like and what you'll get in the box. So this is the box. As you can see, it's a very clean, sustainable, designed, minimalistic box. So as I go ahead and start unboxing, here is the first look to the AP. Now, we have included an installation guide with the AP. This does come with a QR code with very detailed instructions for this access point. We now have changed the form factor of our AP. This is slightly different than what our customers and partners are used to. We now have a more symmetrical square shape to the AP to ensure that we have the required physical separation between the radios to accommodate all the 4x4 client serving radios. And we do have a lot of them. There are three client serving radios, a scanning radio and an IoT radio inbuilt into this AP. Now, as we become more compliant, we want to take advantage of the Cisco universal mounting bracket. Again, this is included in the box along with all the hardware that's needed. And we have also included the T-Rail mounting bracket to mount this AP on the ceilings. So all these uh, hardware and the mounting is included in the box uh, with the AP tucked in a really nice packaging as you just saw. Now let's talk about the AP over here. And as you can see with that square form factor, we are able to use this mounting bracket. It mounts right on to the AP. Now, another change with the square form factor we have made is move the LED from the side of the AP to the front of the AP. Now, this will help in a lot of troubleshooting scenarios where folks want to really know which AP am I looking at and which AP I'm troubleshooting. We now have two ethernet ports on the AP. These both ports can be used for link aggregation as well as power sharing between the two and will also be supporting high availability from these two ports. We also have support for an AC power adapter. This is for a more work from home setup where you can power up the AP using this AC power adapter. Now we have also gone ahead and added a USB port to the device. As you can see, this USB port is a type A port to unlock a sleeve of third party applications and to provide more connectivity options with a 9.5 watt output power. Now, if you are not using the USB port, we have provided a covering to make sure that this port is concealed the times when it is not getting used. Now, another change that we have made is towards the ethernet bay. Now, as you can see over here, we have intentionally made it little flatter and more wider so that you can plug in your CAT 60 cables more seamlessly as you're mounting this AP on your ceiling. If you're interested in learning more about how Wi-Fi 6E can benefit your business or want more information about our MR57 access point, please contact us today on the below link and we'd be happy to help you. Thank you for your time today. Have a good one, folks. Bye-bye.